there was a dude, Tino Femera. You guys are familiar yeah. with Tino. You know? So we did, uh, we had a long-term surveillance and, and wiretap on his stuff that he, I think he, I think he passed away at this he point. Passed. But, he moved to Long Island when he got out, which I thought was interesting. I was surprised. Yeah. Why. I was wondering why. And he's, well, he was a man. bat guy. He liked, he liked to hit people over the head with bats. So <laughs> my old man, as an arson investigator in the fire department, he used to tell stories about this dude who used to like to smack people around with bats. So when we ultimately arrested Tino, I got the opportunity to kind of be there. I was one of the bosses and, you know, kind of said to him, Hey, you know, my dad was looking at you for, uh, for arson. And he was, a, he was, who was your dad? You know, yeah. Freddie Diorio. He's like, yeah, one of the most respectful guys I've ever met. You know? So I'm like, yeah, no, I know. You know? And so you, you guys are like this. I never saw my father interrogate anyone, obviously, yeah, yeah. you know, young kid, but he yeah. was late sixties, started the arson squad in Newark during the riots. There were shit burning left and right. And yep. he was just going crazy.